here's three cute little items from this um, wonderful repository of interesting things. 2005, second best case. This is a magic trick, sort of. That's a, well, also it's, it's a little spinner. This is my favorite one. It's so, so clever. I'll take it apart at the end to show how neat it is, but it's got a lovely action, that one. So it's my favorite. It's going to go last. I'll show you the first one. is a, a very neat little magic trick for kids who like magic to be made easy. It's a little box like this. And it's got an opening there, and it's got a, a, I see you, sir. and then what you do is you bring in, you close the box, you get your pencil off a pencil, and you put it in, and you're going to penetrate the box all the way through with a bit of luck. I'll push, 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 there we are. Now what I've got to do is somehow is to open the box without too much, giving me too much away. That's better. Look through there. Close the box again, put your hand over there and pull, 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 back. How did I do it? Well, it's, no, I won't give it away. I shouldn't. But it's quite clever. It's got a vacant space there. And yet when the, pen, the, pencil, goes, the pencil goes right the way through to the far side and comes out, it's invisible. So, good one. The next one is just a very sweet little French, French item for um, deciding who's going to pay for the next drink, I think it is. I'll see if I can get this in the focus first. And on the back, you see, it's got a little spinning point here. So when I put it on the table, and you put it, uh, you've got a row of people sitting around having a drink. Okay, who's got the next um, drink? Who's going to pay for the next drink? You do that and see what's going to happen. It might be me. Perhaps I've got to pay for the next drink. No, 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 no. Oh, I think it's somewhere near you. Would you mind? <laughs> it's a neat thing, then. It's very, very simple. Just a little bit of wood. A little thing to show who's going to pay for the next drink. The last item is my favourite. It's all made of plastic, and it's absolutely brilliant, this, especially when I take it apart. It's a, it's, it's, a, it's a pair of monkeys on a seesaw, which descends and rocks back and forward. To get it back, I'll start at the top here. But it's the segments which are so neatly done. Uh, boom, 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 boom. There we are. That was very top. Two monkeys. About there. I've got to hold the bottom and I let go of it and see what it does. But look what happens. You just pull that apart like that. It just flips apart like that. And that pulls out. And that flips apart like that. And that comes off. And the monkeys come off on the base. Somehow. Oof. And the whole thing comes apart in a very, very neat little packet. The whole thing comes in a very neat little packet at the end. So all in pieces. And it makes an absolutely brilliant little toy because it works so well. The idea that you can click, 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 click is superb, I think. I think that's a very, very, very clever bit of um, design work. A seesaw. But all in pieces now. <laughs>